please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Title, Capturing Live Output of a Script in Python, a Step-by-Step -step Tutorial. Introduction. Capturing live output of a script in Python is a common task, especially when you want to interact with external processes, run system commands, or simply capture and process the output of your own Python scripts. In this tutorial, we'll explore different methods to capture live output and discuss how to use them effectively with practical code examples. Methods for capturing live output Using subprocess module The subprocess module in Python provides a way to spawn new processes, connect to their input slash output slash error pipes, and obtain their return codes. We can use this module to capture live output. This example captures the output of the LSL command line by line. Using IO module The IO module provides the string IO class, which allows us to treat strings as file-like objects. We can redirect the standard output or error streams to string IO and capture the live output. Replace the comment with the code whose output you want to capture. Using contextlib module. The contextlib module provides the redirect underscore stout context manager, which simplifies the process of capturing live output. Replace the comment with the code whose output you want to capture. Conclusion Capturing live output in Python is a crucial skill for various tasks. In this tutorial, we explored three different methods, using the subprocess module, the IO module, and the contextlib module. Choose the method that best fits your use case and integrate it into your scripts to efficiently capture and process live output. Chat GPT